Guys, welcome back to Hyperlight Drifter. I'm standing amongst the bodies just like I was when we left. Look at all this wreckage. Look at what I've done. Spy me. Look at it! Uh, where were we? We were just headed towards the boss. We're just gonna go wipe out this side. I'm gonna see how far I go. I'm just gonna kind of drift, you know? I'm not gonna try and... I'm not gonna try and do it a bunch. I'm just gonna try and... <laughs> yeah, Bazinga. Okay, yes, Bazinga. Yes, I did it. I nailed it. Yeah. Bazinga. I just wanna, I just wanna kind of like wander. If I find a dungeon, I might beat it. If I die, I might leave. I don't know. We'll see. I'm gonna just try and go kill this boss, which requires that I get at least, what, three? That was the craziest thing to me, uh, is that I randomly stumbled upon a dungeon. That's like what this game's all about. There's so much. There's so fucking much. Look at this beautiful little scene here. Boom, now I got one dollar. So, so these are just quarters. They're called like gear boxes or something. I don't know, but uh, you put enough of them together to make Borderlands. If, if you put four of them together, you get one dollar, and nothing costs more than three dollars hmm. in the whole world. See, like you can just kind of get around to like weird spots. You know what I'm saying? What's that about? That dash goes way farther than I expected to. It always does, right? You're like, surely it doesn't just want me to dash. Oh. Oh, man. It's giving me health. Not a good sign. So those bear guys, I think, are also... I think I think those bear guys are corrupted drifters. I'm not 100% on that, but, like, you see how they have, like, the, ha the, the cap, the cap that I have, and they're, like, lumbering, but they're, like, kind of the same color as me almost? I think that's what's going on here. They got like a slash. Yeah. Clean. Sometimes you're just on it and you feel like a Jedi and sometimes you're just not on it and you feel like shit. <laughs> that's life. But it's also Hyper Light Drifter. I knew you were here, you little fucker. Yo, he was coming, man. I knew he was there. I just sensed that there was something there. Look at these fucking... We secret boys today. Look at this. See that? That's one of those tablets over there. What? It's taunting. Oh, the, it's taunting. Like me. the obelisk? Yeah. If you, like, go over to it, it's, like, kind of like Fez. It, like, is like, y'all. And then it gives you, like, like a code. Mm. Mm. All right. Slide on through. Just getting secret after secret today. It's feeling great. Yeah, yeah. For someone There's who's the one. talking about just like breezing through this, you're just naturally finding these things. That's the what's so. That's what's so fun. It's got that like Breath of the Wild vibe. Look at that. That's where I was before. Where mm -hmm. I was like, look at that item. Um, it just like leads you to shit by teaching you the language of secrets. It's tight. I don't even think I can get in here yet. Yeah. Like, this isn't even the way. Quote, unquote, the way. It's just like a little secret area. Now you have to keep that in mind. Yeah. And actually, the map is really good in this game. Like, if you look at it, it doesn't seem like much because it doesn't track the drifter, like, one-to-one, -one, right? Because it's not a one-to-one -one map. But it also has this. This is the, like, underground map. And it's like, yo, you know those dungeons? Bazinga. I didn't know. Yeah. That's how you, like, get around. That's how you can kind of, like, aim yourself at stuff. It's still not direct because the way they did it is, like, the map, like, purposefully kind of, like, obscures stuff a little bit. So it's, like, still you got to kind of discover how to get there. But, Yeah. Shout out to the ribs. I hate these dogs because they like attack a little earlier than the other enemies. So you really got to be proactive. Well, I was going to say, I found out with a lot of the enemies in this game, it was kind of, once again, Dark Souls-ish, where I had to wait for them to make the first movement and then I would attack. Yeah. It depends on the enemy. That guy is really annoying because he, he jumps at you kind of early. 
It's like purposefully timed to be like kind of annoying. Did I kill them both? Mm hmm. And it's got the kind of like heal mechanic, kind of borrowed from Dark Souls a little bit. But not really. Shouts to the ribs, though. We rib boys now. And I got some health over here. It must be my birthday. I need the chain dash and I need the fucking bullet reflect to feel like a real hyperlight drifter. I thought you were just gonna say like a Jedi. I I mean this game, let's be real, this game is just like off-brand Jedi simulator. <laughs> like, in the sense of like wish fulfillment. It is exactly what that is. But like in terms of lore and presentation, like I don't think there's been a Jedi game this good. Are you kidding me? So cool. Yeah. There's no game, there's no Star Wars game with this much style. I was gonna say, I mean, your closest one is like Knights of the Old Republic. That's just a good game, but I wouldn't say it's like stylish and like subtle. No, no, but I was thinking more like uh, lore behind it. Oh, yeah, yeah. Like deep, good story. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Star Wars doesn't have a lot of that anyway. That's not really what Star Wars is about. Not the thing, man. Yeah. Telling like a subtle story is like not what you do in an entire world based around good guys and bad guys. <laughs> Light side and dark side. But subtle. But subtle. Darth Vader. Dark father. Get wrecked. Bet you like, if you speak Dutch, that probably means father. Or something. Swedish. Somewhere in there. In that realm. Oh shit. There's a lot more guys than I thought. Hyperlight Drifter 2017. What year did this come out? 2015? Yeah. 2016, maybe. Got one health. I can't like see them. There it is. Woo! Oh, I tried to reflect it. Yeah, you don't have that. God damn it. Did I come out of there? You came out the top. Yeah, okay. Not from here? No. This is nothing. That's why. You grabbed a health thing right there. Got it. All right. Oh, yeah, we got raccoon boys. Or at least I think they're raccoons. Boxes. These guys are so cool to me. Yeah. You think this is the hardest way? Well, I only played the one, but based on what the developers were talking about, it seems like this is the hardest. Yeah, that might be true, actually. This is... I might be SOL on the boss on this side. This is a hard boss. Uh, yes, but... Or actually, I don't... I'm not 100% sure. Well, I remember. Well, is this the one with the floor? The boss like messes with the floor a lot. I think so. Sorry, dude. Shouldn't have stood by those exploding barrels that were all conveniently placed right next to you. You knew I was coming. That was a good guy. That was not a good guy. You just murdered a friend. No a way. A potential friend. No way. You'll never know. I will. I've played this before. And you've murdered him every time. <laughs> not preemptively. Not every time. Oh! I have never he, seen that he's shit. He's got the reflect. That motherfucker unlocked the reflect before I did. Oh, dude, I'm gonna die. Oh, boy. Two hits on oh, boy. Gotta cool it down. Keep it cool like the drifter. Whoops. Blow myself up like the drifter. All right. <laughs> Secret. Where is it? There's gotta be a secret here. Because of the little thing oh. on the floor. No, yeah, you know why? Because somebody's still alive somewhere. Like, there's like a switch that needs to be flipped or something. Because there's still like these buttons everywhere. These uh, little walls blocking me from shit. Oh, how rude. Yo, shout out to Stephanie Tanner. 
<laughs> Woo! Shout out to Jar Jar Binks. <laughs> Stephanie Tanner and Jar Jar Binks, what a pair. Some say they're the same person. What a pair of jokesters. Nobody's ever seen them in the same room. Just saying. Just throwing it out there, man. I want to believe Fox Mulder. Alright. Yo, go was down. That? Was it over there? No, it's over here. Yeah. Yeah, it's gone now, see? Mm -hmm. I can just walk right through. Yo, we got a secret fucking triangle, boys? Yeah, we got a secret triangle, boys. That animation, by the way. So fucking good. So fucking good. One down. And actually, the cool thing is, is there's actually eight. Uh, per side? Yeah. So there's actually a lot more to get, and like each, there's like enough secret doors that require eight that there's like worth to it. Mm. If you know what I mean. There it is. Look at all these dead guys. Racking them up. About to go spend those in the town once I find a teleport, you better believe it. Hey, you really rocking with them dollars. I got like two dollars. I got two whole bucks. Burn a hole in my hyperlight pockets. Where the fuck do I go? Down this way? No, there's nothing down here, right? Yo, check the map. Like, probably north I can go. Some maybe, maybe to the left there. Yeah, definitely to the left. That's like the way. Oh, am I dumb? God, I need that chain drift. It's not even actually that good. Like, it's actually not useful for spamming to get around. It's like pretty hard to control yourself, but sure. But it's, feel... it's kind of like uh, when you play a Metroid game and you get far, but then you restart the game. Yeah. And you have all that lack of mobility that you had before. Yeah, I feel slow. I feel slow without it. Here we go. Clean. I love when a regular enemy drops it. That means you're like killing it. That's how it feels to me. <clears throat> feels like the game's like, good job, dude. Feels like they're swiping right on the killing it app. Dude, I wish the killing it app still existed. We were like, let's make that. Oh, you fucking... Never happened. Now the joke is dead. Nah. Yeah, but now you got twice. Nothing over there. And then we're at the save point. Is that what's good? Is this a way? Yes. Save point number one reached. Party over here. Music just drops here. Very cool. Warp here anytime using the map. Yeah, that's like the only text that ever appears. Time to go down there. Or time to go down here. Oh, see, there's an eight door right there. Secret? I see the symbol. What's the secret? There has to be a secret when there's a symbol. Boom. Okay, so there's like a little secret over there. Everything for a reason. Very cool stuff. So maybe I go this way now. And head down to that secret. Right here. See the little symbol? Mm. Boom. Right here. Show me. Show me the road. Boom. We're in there. Secret boys. Yeah, this is a little secret path, right? This might be like a whole thing. I don't I don't remember. There's definitely something going on. Hi.
You just gotta get in there really early with those fucking dogs, or else they, they're gonna take a bar. They love taking that bar. I mean, who doesn't love taking a bar? It's true. Yo, look! Yo. <laughs> Lucky boys. Lucky boys. <laughs> Called it. I used the force on that. You see what I'm saying? Jedi Simulator. That was me, dude. Dude, I already got two on this side. I'm feeling groovy, man. I'm making- I'm making my way downtown. Walking fast? Yeah. Who's that? Michelle Branch? Who's that? Vanessa if I Carlton. could fall. Vanessa Carlton. No. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. I don't how, know. How dare you confuse the two. Dude, look, I got no horse in the race. I got no skin in the game with that. You know Michelle Branch became a country music singer? She sounds like she did, based part, on her name. Part of the band The Wreckers. Oh, really? Mm-hmm. Like, right now? I don't know anymore. That's crazy. Before time. That's insane. Dude, I am, like, killing it, and I haven't even gone in one full dungeon yet. Yo, speaking of which, go up to that dungeon. I'm on my way. Isn't that dungeon... Oh, up straight up, huh? Let's see what this is. Like I said, like, I've played this game a couple times through, but... There's... there's a lot... In yeah, this game. It's, it's really branching. Like, if I was a speedrunner and this was all I did, I would know more, but... What's up, Dark? Oh, yeah, I think this is like a full-on... ...experience. Oh, fuck. We're already on the automatic turrets and I can't even hide right there? <laughs> yeah, this is... This is the area I went that bodied me when I first got here. Doesn't even turn them off. It just like unlocks the thing you need to unlock. Can I even break this thing? No. Yeah, but look at how well you made it through there. I feel good. I don't know if I can make this. Yeah. Well, I know, but I don't have chain dash. <sighs> Easy. Oh, I don't know about this one. We'll see. Wow, really? The game was like, nah, fuck you, bitch. Do this one again. I know for sure you can do it. Oh, timing. Because I don't think I ever had a chain dash. Look at that. Very controlled button presses. Keeping it tight. Keeping it clean, drifting like a fucking master. Give me that shit. Give me that shit. <laughs> Yo. There's some big boys coming up. So this kingdom got wrecked because when they fought off their titan, mm -hmm. they, um, they used like this crystal, I think. So you think each of these quadrants fought off a different titan? Um, not necessarily like one to one, but there's a there's a specific screen that I really like in this area that reminds me of uh, of the of this. And I think what happened is, and you'll see like people stuck in this crystal a mm -hmm. lot. You saw some of the warriors stuck in it. I think it like they like went too hard on a weapon that they like couldn't control, and it like um like took over their whole civilization and ruined it. But that's really interesting there, just what happened with these guys actually crystallizing you. Yeah, look. Like, that's what happened to these people, I think. It's locked? Oh, wait, open it. Is it this? What's, what's that shiny? It's just a little asshole in there. Seriously? I haven't been up top yet, though. Yeah. Is this actually locked, really? Okay. Yeah, we got some frame rate dips. What's so good? Oh, that's a lot of gun guys, and I can't reflect bullets, can I? I 
can't hit that switch till uh you kill them all. No, I need the rail gun. I need the rail gun because that's a special one of those. That's a special one of those uh little switches. Mm. Shit. Okay, see that one? That one doesn't need it. Oh fuck. Not my favorite. Gotcha. He took that guy on no problem. It's more of these that I'm not psyched on. The blocks. I saw you open. You can't fool me. Is there anything over here? Is this secret, boys? No? Just a cornerman? Alright. What's up with this? Just to see what's in here. Cool. I guess I got a health out of that. Maybe maybe you won't be able to see which one of those you can unlock, but now you know like the middle, the middle one's the one only has the stuff. health. Yeah. Got to go ham on those guys. <laughs> yeah, you just go into these places. You're like, "Uh, I'm going to swing." You got to go ham. Got to teach him. Okay. Oh fuck me. All right. That's right, I took one hit. That's not a good deal. Man, I gotta get that bullet reflect. That is like driving me crazy. Oh boy. I would love the bullet reflect. I would love the uh uh Oh my god. The bullet reflect would be dope. I would love the um what do I want? I want the grenade. So you want that double dash? Actually, the chain dash, the bullet reflect, and the thing where when I dash through bullets, I am fine. Well, you'll get them all soon. It's true. Uh, next time on Beard Bros, I'm gonna unlock that cage. See you Which guys. one? That one right there, look. That see one? That see that guy? The one with the big guy? Yeah. I'm gonna fight that guy. Fuck him. Oh, baby. Beard Bros. Big underwater Gucci. Big wet Gucci. I'm Gerard. I'm, I'm Gerard. And I'm Alex. And I'm, I'm Alex. Frog in a car. You did it! Great. It's cute. What's good? What's good? Yes. Did you really do this? I did. Oh. Always take the time. Next time on Beard Bros.